Use this sales script to massively increase your sales so you have a very strong frame at the beginning which sets your client up without having to waffle That's that you, um, you had your to save a load of time and you begin the sales process right at the beginning to qualify whether the client is going to be an ideal client for you. Hey, that's pretty good. Remember to smash that subscribe button if you want videos to help you grow your business. The biggest problem in sales calls is that people open up talking about themselves. They think rapport is about sharing their personal story. <laughs> If you don't have a solid framework at the beginning, you will lose a lot of time. You don't set up the problem very clearly. If you don't set up the problem very clearly, then the conversation could go all over the place. If you don't set up the problem very clearly, then there isn't a solution off the back of that. Damn! After years and years of going through my clients' consultation calls, I devised a very simple process that's authentic, not pushy, so that you can qualify whether the client is an ideal client, they have the problem or not, and whether you want to take that client on or not. Here's how it goes. Hi, Jan, it's great to meet you. As you know, my name is Ed. My position is I own Clients and Automation. Where are you calling from today? Just, just a very simple, where are you calling in from today? Your location. We're talking maximum 20 seconds. You're calling from London. Okay, how is it over there? You know, what's the weather like? Really simple. I had a client recently and she's in the baby niche and she started opening up a conversation about babies and the problem with that is that you know 20 minutes later and she's wasted a lot of time you need to take leadership at this part of the conversation so time is always a barrier people don't have unlimited amount of times so a call is an inter interruption to that so I know we have limited time together if you have a pen and paper to take notes are you ready to get started asking them for a pen and paper is a simple command to see if they follow that command I recommend some pre content to get this one already most of our clients are turning up ready to take notes again this is less than 20 seconds keep it short straight to the point the best rapport is built on understanding their problem. So we want to get down to the problem as specific as quickly as possible. Not sharing how many kids you have or where you grew up. Second part of this is you're stating the context of the actual call. So what I found works best on these calls, Jan, is I'll ask you some very important questions so I can diagnose effectively your current problem. This is important. The more specific you are on their problem at the beginning, the more aligned the whole process will be. For example, growing your business versus fixing your ads. They, they are very different problems. Growing your business is an overview of the business. Fixing your ads is very specific to lead flow. A problem like stopping you from moving further forward in life, now that's an overview problem. Don't do that. More specifically, what is the biggest challenge or problem right now that you have with overwhelm? More specific, more detailed on the problem. Again, this goes back into being clear on your niche. If you're not clear on your niche, make sure you subscribe to the channel and you can watch my video on how to pick the right niche for you. And then you're going into, and if it sounds like I can help you, and if it sounds like we're a good fit, I'll explain what we have here and how our process works, how the system works. At the end, if it makes sense, you can make a decision of whether you want to be part of that or not. And if for whatever reason, I don't think it's a right fit, I'll go out of my way to find something that is a right fit for you. Sound good. That is setting up the offer at the end. In all my years, no one, when, when I've come to the offer and how you segue to the offer without being pushy is just quite simply, where would you like to go from here? In all my years of doing it, no one has ever said, I don't want to hear the offer because you've said it so transparently at the beginning. Now, I might also add in there a little side note, regardless of whether we work together or not, you will leave this session knowing exactly what you need to do to fix the problem. And that is, if you haven't seen my videos on before, the second level of value. So you're telling them what they need and why it's the quickest way. That is huge value. Remember, pause and do not say anything. Let that silence sit there and let them say okay. Don't be awkward. I know people know about being silent on a call. The reason that you want to be silent is so that you can let that person think in their own time and they feel heard. Don't let it go over 20, 30 seconds or be awkward. Make sure you smash that subscribe button if you want daily videos to help you grow and level up. Just a heads up, if you want a free session with one of my team, click the link. Do it! And you can get a grow your coaching business strategy plan free of charge. I'll see you soon.